I would have to say my personal style is literally unapologetic. Like I'm gonna wear whatever I wanna wear. My slippers will have heels on them. My Crocs will have heels on them. I'm gonna throw anything on and not care what anybody thinks about it, whether it's vintage or whether it's custom made or whether whatever, I'm gonna wear whatever I wanna wear. So it expresses my personalities, my multiple personalities. Okay, my personal style, I love being sexy. Listen, you can put a bag on me and I'm gonna make sure I look good on it. So it's just, you don't let the clothes wear you, you wear the clothes. My personal style is very true to me. My personal style is very chameleon-esque. I'm a true New Yorker, I'm a native New Yorker, so you can get me in denim and Tim's, but I'm also, I'm a style savant, so you can get me in the latest cashmere, you can get me in a good leather, you can get me in great pieces. I would definitely say my personal style is edgy, I always gotta add in sexy. Even when I'm like fully clothed down, I just wanna make sure that there's something that just always comes back to who Kitty is. And you don't think about Kitty without seeing some type of pizzazz. <laughs> it's like I be in between like a Little Kim or Avril Lavigne. I give like a, a hip hop rock star. That's literally what it is. Cause I like to mix like leathers and the mini skirts and the, I be having fun with it. I really do. I would describe my personal style. I'm gonna say it's classy. I'm a classy girl. I used to say it's basic, but somebody told me it was like, nah, 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 nah. You a classy girl. I feel like I have enough personality that I don't need to wear that on my clothes. I like my clothes to accentuate my features that I already have. Bad B energy, that's what it is. <laughs> my personal style, well, I switched it up. I got tired of wearing spandex and I was over it. So now I'm really getting into stuff that I like, which should be like, like I be wearing my gold little tooth sometimes. Like I be doing my little thing. I don't know how, how I would really describe it. Is it diverse maybe? I would describe it in a diverse way. Like I get to be myself. I get to be all different versions of me. My personal style is just fly. I just feel like I'm fly. It doesn't matter what I put on. I can always make it look fly. That's what I think. <laughs> this outfit? No, I'm just kidding, <laughs> I'm just kidding, <laughs> I'm just kidding. I would never wear a short dress and moon boots. I would never do that in a fur. I feel like that would look crazy, not it, sis. I would never wear kitten heels. I just, I just don't see a reason for them, it's just not my style. I wouldn't wear a cheetah print, it's too bold for me. So that's just the only reason why. Nothing against cheetah print, I love cheetah print, but not always. <laughs> Okay, I wouldn't mix like plaids and stripes and polka dots. I wouldn't mix a whole bunch of patterns. I would never do that. Turtlenecks, I'm not really crazy about turtlenecks. It all depends. High turtlenecks, I don't. I, I can't. Right now, I like this company called Meshki. I really like to look clean and bring out the goddess energy that I have. At this present moment, I do not have a go-to designer, and the reason being is every day, something is new and interesting, so I don't like to put all my eggs in one basket. I like to cast my net as wide as possible. My go-to designer would be Off-White or Louis Vuitton. My style is so broad that is, there's no go-to designer. It's more of like the fit for me, like it has to be tailored. So even like I'll buy jeans size 36, yeah, and I, my, the waist will be cut down to 25. So it's just like, if the fit is perfect, baby, I don't care whether it's an uh, upcoming designer, underground designer, or it's the top designer. I care about the fit. It gotta fit my body good, period. Jane. My go-to designer, Fashion Over Outfits. It just sh 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 fits perfect on me. If I'm running fast and I need something quick, I would definitely say Alexander Wang and Mugler. I don't like to double dip, you feel me? Like, I believe in wearing one out, wearing a piece or one piece twice. My black Chanel bag, I love my black Chanel bag because it go with everything, my beige Chanel bag. Um, I love my Christian Dior runners. Well, oh, my sweatsuits, hello. I love me some sweatsuits, I'm a sweatsuit girl. I could be in sweatpants, pajamas all day. That's just me, I'm like a chill girl. I dress up because I gotta dress up to look pretty and you know, work, but I could be in loungy wear all day. Maybe my Louis Vuitton pea coat. That's something that I feel like I would never get tired of. It's just, it's a pea coat, it's Louis Vuitton, I got the monogram on it, it's just fly, I love it. 
I got these Balenciaga slides. They're like furry and pink and I literally ran them down to the ground because when I'm on the go, I don't wanna wear sneakers, I don't wanna wear nothing. I just wanna throw my foot into something, go up, go about my business and yeah, those are my favorite shoes. Well, one of my bigger splurges was I think my first vintage Chanel. It was it's from 1997 where they still did uh, like real 14 karat gold hardware. You know, all these bags that these girls have today, they need to understand that their hardware. After 2003, their hardware is plated. This is real gold hardware. I bought that bag and that was my biggest splurge. The funny thing is I never wear her. I rarely take it out of the house. It's like a showpiece for me. If I could swap closets with anyone on the cast, it'll be Dream Doll. She's fly, really fly. Yeah. Dream doll. I like her style. Her style is cute. Her bags and she got all the little funky stuff. I like all that. I would switch closets if I had to choose with Dream Doll because I feel like she definitely has popped out with a lot of cute looks from what I've seen on Instagram. I love my closet. It's perfect for me. <laughs> I don't want to trade with nobody. I don't want to trade with nobody in the world. You feel me? Dream. Ooh. I think I would swap closet with Ella. I love her style, and she got nice bags and shoes. That's swap. I would definitely swap with Ella. Cause my girl got the pieces, she always got the pieces. Oh, Ella, them bands is in that closet. She be running it up on some clothes. Okay, yeah, she dresses now. I love how she dresses. If I could swap closets with anybody, it would be Ella because I can sell all them Birkins. Well, actually, I keep the Birkins. But everything else, I'm selling all that bull and getting all the money. 